When the Bible says, for this shall a man leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife and the two shall become one flesh. There's something deep that he was saying. In the first place, I've been asking and looking and thinking, when God created Adam and Eve, do they have father and mother? Did they have father and mother? They had only God who was part of them. So where is the father and mother God is telling them to live? So leave your father and mother, join to your wife, and, and, and become one flesh. That got me thinking, but what God was trying to say is that as long as there is mother and there is father, it is the representation of the flesh. For them, you came out of the flesh. But with me, there is a spiritual communion. So in you, order for you to have a wonderful, a good, and a clean marriage. Come out of the flesh that the two of you may come as one and associate with me. So any association that is flesh, God is telling you, cut out of it and cleave to your wife. So at times, the relationship we are having with the opposite sex should be out of the flesh. Leave it and clear. I keep saying this and I will say it to you tomorrow. Any association you are having with the opposite sex, without your spouse knowing it, there is a hidden agenda. Because it is us and not I. So why would you shield her and shield him away from your spouse? If she want to be a friend, she should be our friend, not your friend. If he wants to be a friend, let him be our friend, not your friend. Because the moment she came in close, I am going to be apart. So any opposite sex that is a close spouse to your spouse, chase them away. Because if you don't, they are going to come in between. This is closeness. This is what we mean by closeness. And this is one flesh by what God said. There is no space for an extra outsider here. But the moment you shift and you bring the outsider here, to be close to her, to be close to me, there is a problem. Because an enemy and an external factor has entered. And that is when flesh begins to manifest. And that is why he said, leave the flesh and cleave to him. He knows what he's talking about. Most of the time we have abused our spouse in the name of, yes, I'm trying to protect my spouse. Because if you know, you know that lady is very aggressive. And I, I don't want her to start insulting my wife anyhow. That is why I'm keeping her arms leg. Somebody that has disrespect for your wife, what are you doing with that person? If not that you, you're a suspect. I don't understand. And we have used this in so many ways to destroy our home. When he created them, he said, let us make man in our own image. You know what it is? Come, one, two, three. Let me just have this. Okay, just sit down. I need one more man, please. I'm closing now. I just want to do this illustration. Please, I come. I need another lady and I need another man. Now, he said... When he created, okay, please, you come. Wilson, come. You come this way. Just stand here. Give me another man. He said, God the Father, one man, somewhere come. God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Please shift a little. This is Adam, Eve, husband, wife. He said, the three heads came together and said, let us make man in our image to be like us. Look alike of us. And the three of them decided to create their look alike. And when they created the man and the woman, the three of them, because of their supernatural power, entered into themselves and became one. And then they now entered here and then it became like them. So like this looks like God. Let me have one moment. Come, 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 come. Just run, come. Just to get, make it clear. Like this look like God. Like this look like God. 
We are three. I am here. We are three of us. We are here. So anytime you introduce something that does not look like this and does not look like this, you are going out of the contents and assignment and will of God. And the reason why your marriage is suffering today is because he created it like this. Five of you come. Five of you come. Run, 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 run. Five guys come. In the name of ungodly association. Join to these people. 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 Come up behind. Come behind. Come behind. Come behind. Stand here. You come now. Where did they go? Stand here. I'm running out of. Come back. Come back. Come back. Now see how we have mad the union that God created. We can't even know where the husband and the wife is anymore. We can't recognize where the regardless is in this home. Today we come, we see abuse. Tomorrow we see anger. Next tomorrow we see hatred. We see depression. We see divorce. We see separation. We see animosity. All in the name of bringing fleshy association into what God gave us a platform. The Lord bless you. Rise on your feet.